Hello guys, welcome to another Calm Gamer Discussion. Today, we're going to talk about an RPG. And not just any RPG. <coughs> Excuse me. An RPG that was on the Game Boy, DS, and 3DS. We're talking, of course, Mario and Luigi. Which, by the way, is a good series. My Luigi was a series that I was looking so forward to. And let me be honest, I was not looking forward to something on a handheld. I had played Super Mario RPG, which was a super super game on a Super Nintendo pun intended um, but then this commercial came out some buddies working together and it is amazing Superstar Saga was where it started the game it had some gimmick, some problems here and there which I'll get to in a bit this is going to be a four part, uh, actually five part, because I'm not going to make you guys sit through this entire episode, talk about the entire game series as a whole, but we'll talk about them as I go along. So Superstar Saga takes what we love about Mario and involves Luigi, who inadvertently becomes a second character in the game. It was a weird game. I'll tell you that right now. It is a very, very weird game. It involves a bad guy named Cacletta. Not Bowser. Cacletta, who, by the way, has stolen Princess Peach's voice. And you have to go out and get it back by going to. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Bean Bean Valley. And everything is named after some synonym of laughing. You got Hoo Hoo Mountain. And got... It's just, it's, it's funny. Now, by the way, I will talk about the remakes. Well, one remake, because I don't have the other one. But, anyway, so, that'll be out later on the road. So, it's up to Mario and Luigi to go find Cacletta and get back Princess Peach's voice. I'm not going to spoil anything for you guys if you guys have not played this game. But, trust me, play it. It is so so good. So, you meet up with a bunch of funny characters. One, I, I... I don't know. I really don't hate him, but he's annoying. And that is the prince of the game. He comes in every minute. Every so often to mess with the Mario Brothers. And why? I get it. He wants to be the, the hero of the story. But Mario and Luigi. It's not called Prince. It's called Mario and Luigi. Superstar Saga for a reason. Now Bowser does play a big part in this game. But he's more of a side villain kind of like Super Mario RPG. Now, he gets some, he, I'm going to tell you right now, he is turned into a villain later on down in the game and then turned into a bigger villain later on down in the game as well. All I got to say is, it's good, but damn, is it hard. There are a lot of bosses in this game that will test your patience 
to the limit, especially the final boss, which is done in two parts. And see, is not easy. So, why is this game probably one of my favorite games? One reason, one reason only. It has Mario Luigi. Now, as a kid, when I played Super Mario RPG, I was like, what's a Luigi? You know, we got games that were <coughs> um, featuring Luigi, Mario's Missing, Luigi's Madison, and Dr. Luigi, which came out not too long ago. So, people probably ask me, will probably ask me, what, why is this game so good? The bow's abilities. You don't just attack monsters as a, as a team, like you did in Super Mario RPG. You have one of the coolest things in this game, bow's attacks, where... Mario and Luigi both get to use an ability they get. There's a bunch of great cameos. There's the hammer bows. There's the Kooplings, <coughs> which come at the end of the game. Pretty awesome. And uh, I don't know. I I liked the game. I still have a, I think I still have it on Game Boy. But I do have it on the virtual console, which kind of made me mad, made me upset that we never got Bowser's inside story, which we'll get to later, um, as a download for the Wii U. I get it. You can't turn it sideways. But, look, you can do it. You can do it. Why didn't it? And I get it. Alpha Dream is no longer a thing. But Nintendo, do us a favor. Give us a chance to play it. So, anyway, it is pretty awesome. If you guys have not played Mario Luigi Superstar Saga, I'm down there. It's. If you have to. Get the remake. It's good, but if you can, before the Wii U eShop goes down, download it on the eShop. And Partners in Time, which is the next game we'll talk about next time, is also on there. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe, share. I'll see you guys in the next video, which will be my Partners in Time. Discuss it.